this is where you'll be going. An island fortress, really. After the war, the nationality of the island was uncertain. If we were given the slightest reason to believe that he has any kind of arsenal, we'd move in on him. Oh, by the way, two months ago, we managed to place a female operative on the island. Since then, we've uh, lost her. That Han, that's O'Hara behind him. Personal bodyguard. Tough, ruthless, as you might expect, being Han's bodyguard. We want you to go in there as our agent. Get us our evidence. There's a radio on the island that you can get to it. And we'll be monitoring it. Look at this map here. Han's Island rests partly within our territorial waters. It. What do you know about Han? He lives like a king on that island. Totally self-sufficient. Now, why doesn't somebody pull off 45 and bang, settle it? No, no guns. Besides, Han would never allow guns on the island anyway. He had a bad experience with them once, and he's fearful of assassination. Can't really blame him. Any bloody fool can pull a trigger. There's a radio on the island. We'll be monitoring it, on the chance that you can get to it. And then you come. Someone will. Mr. Han, you fought well yesterday. Your style is unorthodox, but effective. It is not the art, but the combat that you enjoy. There were some questions which I was forced to ask. I got no answers. What were you looking for when you attacked my guards? Wasn't me. You were the only man outside the palace. I was outside, but I wasn't the only one. You will tell me who else. Mr. Han, suddenly I'd like to leave your island. It is not possible. Bullshit, Mr. Handman. skill is extraordinary and I was going to ask you to join us <laughs> Certain realities. I want us to have a clear understanding. There's no misunderstanding between us.